Alright, so, what's up everybody? Welcome back. I am going to do a little bit of Destiny 2. I will do the beginning parts pre-recorded for um, the time. And then eventually once we get past the beginning and I have the freedom to roam around in Destiny 2, I will actually start live streaming it then. I have not played the first game, so... Yeah. Although I have an idea how a bunch of games roll anyway. <laughs> Since playing all their Halo games are the same. So it's like... Yeah, I really have no choice but to accept them, do I? Don't I? We're going through a loading screen. Since I haven't done the first game. Let's see how Destiny 2 runs. Oh. Well. Yeah, I set the screen. <laughs> I thought the screen was automatically set. Alright, there's good enough. Just your brightness to the symbol is barely visible on the left. Well, actually, that would be the three, but it can hardly be seen. A... All right, now you can see it. It's four. Four is four is four is fine, actually. Uh, subtitle subtitles will automatically be displayed if your language differs from Destiny's two audio cap. If you want forced subtitles on, you can do so here or enable them. All clans, yeah, whatever, I don't care. I was never part of a clan before, and I don't think I will be again. Unless I need to. Activision presents. <laughs> Along with Bungie. <laughs> trying to do this. I never knew you in life. Your first life, anyway. You died on a battlefield long before my time. Something special brought us together. They called it the Traveler. And when it arrived, it changed your world forever. It was a golden age. And for centuries, humanity thrived. Until it didn't. An ancient enemy pursued the Traveler across the universe. Humanity faced extinction. But the Traveler made a choice. Its sacrifice destroyed its ancient enemy and brought life to the ghosts. I am a ghost. More importantly, I'm your ghost. And you are one of the Traveler's Chosen. You are a guardian. Yay. <laughs> I am a guardian. No. This is your destiny. <laughs> Funny. Name drop. Alright, so you can be a Titan, a Hunter, or a Warlock. Which powers quicken the feet, increase the draw. Or aggressive assault and defense. Eh, I was a titan the last time. Fuck it. Oh. Exo. You are an exo. Oh, fuck that. <laughs> fuck that. I'll be a robot all the time if I need be. Although the phases don't really that differ that much. Eh. Yeah, the faces are not that different from each other. They have the same base set. I don't know what the fuck is that one though, but okay. But I kind of like that one the best. Yeah, stick with that one. Uh, face color. That's. Uh, I don't think I really need to change the color. Oh wait, and it changes the eyes. Yeah. <laughs> Death. No. Um, what would be the best? Hmm. Orange? Blue is good. 
Red is good, but I think red is too much. White. Yeah, let's stick with white and mouth. What? What? Well, it will be blue. Head features? Oh. These are the things that were on there. So, like, the little helmet, unicorn, whatever the fuck that is. Attachment. That. All of these look stupid, actually. <laughs> what the hell? Bungie. Thought you were better at design. Eh, yeah, actually, that's the best. Markings? Oh, they're up there. Meh. Don't need any markings, really. I think that's about it. I could be human male or female, but... Nah. I'm a robot. <laughs> robot has no genders. Cora, if you tell me this is a practical joke, well, it kills me to say it, but I, I would be really impressed. Hmm. Impressing you, Cade, is the easiest thing I'll do all day. Let's get serious, people. Zavala, this is my serious face. Can't you tell? Ikora, what have you got? Someone or something has sabotaged the skyline. Oh, so we're basically doing the... Uh... Air comms have been spotty for the last few hours. <clears throat> Every better. sensor beyond the wall has gone dark. Hmm. Maybe it's just the storm. Maybe it's... What are the set feeds telling us? Nothing. Well, that's good, right? No. I mean, they're not there. There are no satellites. And that's not good. Battle stations! Yes, they get bombed and the ball make it in. Starfish. <laughs> or a parasite, I guess. Mm, nah. Giant starfish. Might be the best. Mm -mm. Oh, excuse me. This is City Hawk 723. Anyone home? No response on any channels. Even the emergency frequencies. What is going on back there? Remember when I told you that you fly too fast? Forget I said that. Fly fast. <laughs> I kinda do like the white the white eyes. It, it would have been either the white, the blue, the red is red is a little too much. Red doesn't fit. Um, what else would 
be the best. Orange? Eh, orange fits fine, but not too much. And yes, the city is under attack. Ah, I feel like that's the whole story. <laughs> city is always under siege just because you have a giant ball of, an uh, of ancient immense power that everyone wants let's get moving we need to find Zabala Ikora and Cade Oh hey! Wow, this has this has some kick. <laughs> Damn. That, this gun has really this doesn't make fucking sense. Kit. The Cabal conquer systems by blowing up planets. Whatever they want, it must be here in the last city. Okay. Yep. I cannot. That is really fucking. Crazy. This is Commander Zavala. Civilians, report to evac points. Guardians, rendezvous in the plaza. Our city will not fall. Oh, it's RB for many attack? Huh. Okay, that's interesting. These robots gave up their lives. Hey, you two. Give me a sec. Zavala's doing the hero thing in the plaza. Me? I've got a date with whoever's behind this. Give me a short date. Be a very short date. Hey, security robots and civvies. Over here, Titan. My armory is open to you. Follow the path from there. It will lead you through the hangar to the plaza. I'll take care of these people. If the Cabal want war, give them war. Pick up an auto rifle. These are all the exactly the same, right? Settings. I feel like the uh up, up, up. Okay, everything's there, but um the sensitivity feels low to me. Six. Okay, that's slightly better. Fire though! That was a terrible grenade actually. <laughs> and he died in the fire. I'm already way ahead of you, game. I mean, that was an obvious. Oh, right. I have the hover jump. Whoops. I gotta get used to using that. Oh, hey. I was just looking at the robots and one of them already died. Uh. The other one is like, eh, I could shoot back, but I'm really not gonna bother to shoot back. Oh, hey! Okay. I got that. So much I have to learn since I haven't played the first game. So that one matches with this. Okay. Although it's sort of fucking inaccurate. But I uh, move on from that point. Even if they're fucking supposed to be a warring nation, they really suck at combat. Their command ship. Mm. Oh, hey, uh, I guess I said it to jump over, eh?
No. You gotta be smarter than that. Ow! Yeah, they installed something onto it. I'm assuming either to revitalize its its power again or just to steal the power. One of the two. It just feels that way to me. Sorry, I had to change a couple of things. Uh, very quickly. Uh, oop. And there's where the robots died. <sighs> they could only if they only shot back. Okay, my ghost keeps tagging these cabal as Red Legion. Akora, what do you got? They're elite, ruthless, and rumor is they have never known defeat. Until today. Today they face guardians. But Zavala, they're attacking the Traveler. The Traveler waits. We protect our people at any cost. Yeah, true that. But so far, if I can say if they don't know how to defeat, they just use superior numbers with it so far. I don't think they're elite, <laughs> considering the fact that I killed like, what, over 20 of them already? It didn't take me that long. I'm just saying. Oh, hey. This line until the last civilian is safely away. Incoming! Fall back to my shield! I'm already at your shield. Don't let the pass the gate. The evac shuttles are back there. Ship, it's next on us. <laughs> you guys walk in a fucking straight line, you ain't gonna get anywhere. More Red Legion! Show them what guardians are made of! Shuttles is away. 
but the speaker, he never made it. I'm going to look for him. I've got the plaza. Go with Cora. Find the speaker. We're on it, Commander. Nope, I'm done here. <laughs> I don't need to be here any longer. I'll just move on with my life. Even in the entire attack, the robot janitor will still do his job. Uh, ain't that funny? Oh, oh! Ikora, the speaker is gone. Red Legion, you will take no more from us, and you will find no mercy in me. Zabala, she'll find the speaker. We need to move on that command ship. Now head to the North Tower. I'm sending Amanda Holiday to pick you up. Why do we need to move it on the command ship? I mean, at this point, it's pretty much clear that we have left the city, and it should be a wiser idea to retreat with the civvies. Just saying. Oh, well. Yeah. Ow. Fire, right. Smart. You guys have learned how to use fire! Although, I don't know about the weapon so much. They kind of. Suck. Yeah, we got it. Yep. Ah, uh, well, that was cool. Okay. Right, I gotta get used to the grenade throw because it seems like it lops. Even though I'm a robot, <laughs> seems like it fucking lops. Like, meh. <laughs> I'm I'm too tired to throw things. Ooh. Hmm. Right. Is we need that ship off the field. No, Cinerator. Stop it, please. And now I got a lot of things to pay attention because I have not played an RPG in a while and an MMO style type of game. So it's gonna take some being used to, at least back in the program. Things. Oh, hey. You didn't die with your friends? Oh, there you go. Someone told me you need a ride. <clears throat> Zabala, picked up that guardian you never showed up about? Get them on that command ship! No. Hold on back there. Come on, big guy. Do something. Actually, I would check my statement. More looks like it's like the laser or some sort. Just by the look of it. Alright, Guardian. Time to kick him where it hurts. Yeah, and they get my ass kicked. <laughs> Apparently I'm this big shot guardian. I get my ass kicked by a ten foot tall Darth Malik looking guy. <laughs> I don't know, the cabal can't <laughs> The leader kind of does look like a Darth Malak uh, type of um, guy. Snow and the shields are down, and we'll hit that ship with everything we got. Huh? So that's how you eject those pods? Hmm. I'm just surprised they don't decide to roll off, actually. Oh, hey guys! You guys are a red legion and you're supposed to try to stop me right now. You're not doing a great job of it so far. That hologram could help. Let me take a look. Right, sure! You know what? Don't want to call you Sparky Ghost. I have to come up with a name for you later on. Hmm. Let me have that console. We can find a schematic in there. Okay, 
Okay, the shield generator should be at the bottom of the ship. They have something on their back. Guess it might be an exhaust port or something. I'm assuming because they're not immune to the. Uh, I don't have anything for that actually. Uh, I do have a super though. Fire bed, fire bed. Right. Alright, locked and loaded. No, got it, thank you. Hey, what's your status? Ah, uh, low on ammo. All flaming pits. Traps burning out. I just noticed that these guns don't seem to have a retracted royal uh, recoil. It just seems like this part there just moves. I guess. Well, I guess it makes sense. The cabal would not have as much uh, recoil when sitting in the weapon, so that way they can use primary fire. I guess more better. I guess that pays to be a military power then. <laughs> Oh, you're dropping off more. Uh, I swear. This sort of reminds me of the old days. Ah, uh, the old days. Those days are long past us. Wow. I am disappointed in the grenade, though. Just feels like I'm not even chugging anything. Feels like I just learned how to throw and it's like, eh. Ow. No, you stop that. Renin, the internal blade! Oh, he's getting the ever leading. Oh, he's got his bar down. Oh, you do 31 damage to his head every time I shoot his head. Oh wait, now it's 36. Oh hey. Hey, come on you cabal. I know you can do better than that. Nope. Oh. <laughs> Even if I realized that wasn't a, a sticky, I'm like, eh. If it stops. It's probably something dead. Just my fortune nature, man. Here, have a grenade. I did 128. Hey! Oh, uh, just hide behind there, thank you. <laughs> oh, you AI. Never have learned the lesson of I can hide behind things that you can't shoot. Oh, really? Come on, give it to me. Thank you.
Nope. Can't even shoot the arm. Goodbye. I always get to assume that's always and never the last. And Jeremy! The shield generator should be straight ahead. Yeah, let me reload first. Oh hey, how you doing? <laughs> Didn't expect you to be there. Here, have a grenade. Wow. Grenades OP? <laughs> uh, again, I don't have anything for that. Oh, hey! There's no need to get hostile here. There's no need to make it personal, man. <laughs> Relax. Just doing our jobs. Always make things personal. Gonna run up in your face and try to smack you. All right, destroy the turbines. The shield should fizzle. All right, I learned my lesson from the last time with this shit. <laughs> uh, this stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah. Careful of giant rotating, whatever that is. Oh, I could probably actually get up here. I'll be fine. I hope so. Hey! Yeah, that actually worked. Levels rising. It's working. <laughs> Bungie. Hey. Hello. Just hold the fire. I'm used to tapping too much. Zavala, we did it. The shields are down. Zavala? Let's suppose because I want more accurate shots since I have too much experience Amanda. with accurate shots. Or at least precision weapons in the case. <clears throat> Now I have a helmet? I'm confused. <laughs> How do we come back from this? You don't. Welcome to a world without light. Guardian, something's wrong. Insert meme here. I feel like this has a Halo feel to it still. It's weird. Because <laughs> it's almost exactly the same way. In sort of a way. But, hmm. 
That's... That's that. <clears throat> and I... I mean, hiding behind walls after getting your ass kicked for about... Probably about 200, maybe 300 years. I mean, like 10 or 20, I don't know. I don't know the exact lore of the game, but... I'm pretty sure if you're on the edge of distinction, the smart thing is to hide behind a wall. I mean, I don't know what the Cabal uh, production rate is, but... I <laughs> piece of it. Hmm. The last city, two days after the attack. I can actually view in third person. Minus the fact that for some reason I keep on getting this black sort of screen that pops up saying, You're on the verge of death! You guys seriously did a number. Not really much of a number in the city, actually. Kind of left it pretty much intact. Huh. Some bits and pieces are destroyed, but yeah, they can be replaced. Hmm. I guess someone didn't have a exact landing. Hmm. I guess I guess you won't have a safe landing if you land in a in a giant shaped spear and shot out of a rock, uh, sh shot out of a catapult from a ship. Actually, well, you guys see we cower behind the wall, yet the first thing you don't manage to do is to tear down the wall. I mean... Now I question... Oh, shit. Yeah, but you say we came behind the wall, yet you came to the Traveler, take the light, and now you're gonna be hide behind the wall. I mean, there's a little criticism in your, um, in your, well, not your actions, but your, um, your words. <laughs> oh. You even have vehicles. Or at least some tank-like looking vehicles. Yeah, I guess that makes sense for a military nation. And for some reason have giant... Ah! Yeah, give me a sec, I fall on the... Uh, whatever this is. Okay. The light is gone. They 
taken the city. Traveler. Everything. The Red Legion is killing powerless guardians. We have to get out of here. Yeah. Yeah. Although, how the hell are you powerless? I mean, first of all, you have guns. I mean, I'm pretty sure your guns are not related to any scene of the light, but... Again, I don't know the full lore of Destiny, so... I need to play Destiny 1 probably after I do this one. I'm picking up an emergency broadcast. Rendezvous coordinates. They're evacuating the planet. We're on our own. Um... Why do we need to leave Earth exactly? I mean, the wall is only on a certain portion of Earth. I mean, you can hide anywhere else. Even though I am assuming that the Cabal would probably be thorough in their searches, but... I mean, Earth is a big planet. You can hide pretty much anywhere. And minus the fact that it's all out to nature. City outskirts. Four days after the attack. And look, there's still even egos around here. So, I mean, there's plenty of room to hide anyway. Just not near the city. It's just... These guardians. No chance without their powers. That could be us. Guardian, if you die, I can't resurrect you. We need to be very careful. I'm assuming that probably at least my class or the hunter class might be able to survive without the light. Not so much the warlocks, but... Eh, <sighs> whatever. Hmm? Honored War Beast. That's great. You would think you would give me a little bit more ammo, but... Okay. What? You guys are scared? Come on, I thought I wanted to be recreated with death. Come on. I ain't scared of death. Get over here. vision. Follow the ego, the spiritual path. I guess they must have taken too many cues from Assassin's Creed. <laughs> Follow the ego. Wait, I can't even sprint either? What? Sprinting relies on light? What? <clears throat> Logically wise, I'm... Ah. Twilight gap after one week. Falcon again. Oh, it's a Falcon. Is it following us? Or are we following it? The nah, second one. It's been a been a week guys do you really need to still be in the city oh uh, I guess maybe uh, unfortunately humans have a very high resilience to things <laughs> and the fight never to give up I'm 
really sad that the light is tied into sprinting. Seems rather uh, weird to me, at least. I mean, I understand the fact of double jumping, maybe. Wait, wouldn't I have thrust or something? I, oh, I guess. I guess maybe because everything's powered by the traveler. Hmm. No one has thought of an alternate turn. Oh, oh, that alternate uh, energy source. Oh, hey. Oh, I guess I'll just have to full auto it. Come on! I don't fear death, guys. Come on. Make it a little better! If you want to kill me. Ow. No. expect you to have honor for certain uh, aspects since he has also kind of followed the roots of the elites, sort of. But, eh. There's a chasm, I don't want to go down there. Falky, how you doing? Well, never mind. Not how you're doing. <laughs> I failed to accomplish the jump. Or maybe I was meant to fail. Now look, somebody left a perfectly good guardian lying around. Things must be worse than I thought. And that's our cue. Time to go, people. Um, uh, wait, where? Where are you all going? As far away from here as possible. That falcon, it belongs to you? The name's Hawthorne, and this is Lewis, the best pilot we got. What about you? Fit to fly? Probably gonna need one of these, too. Hey, shotgun. Time to make yourself Why does this look so familiar? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. Why does it look so familiar in design choice? At least to me. City is secure. Those who fled are being hunted, and those foolish enough to remain have been executed. That Victory, as with all things, is yours to claim. So does that also count for the victory is as much yours as mine, old friend. All that remains is the completion of the cage around this great machine. Then we may begin the extraction of its power and put it. To its rightful use. They call it the Traveler. I would contend that other civilizations may be more precise in their naming. Its functions can be controlled and exploited, as we have so clearly proven. Yet they believe it to be a god. Dominus. Gaul. We have spent our lives, you and I, working to reshape our society, reforge our people, 
rebuild an empire nearly destroyed by Callus' greed and corruption. There is nothing in this universe greater than you. The Red Legion will have that machine's power. You will be called Emperor. What more would the Dominus have? I would have words with my guest. Seems like he's more curious about uh, the people who call it the Traveler more than anything else. Even though he despites wanting to use it for exploitation, he just seems a little peculiar on it. <laughs> it's the fact they believe it's a god. Yeah. I mean, if you have something falling down the sky that saves your ass, I mean, I'm pretty sure you're willing to call it a god. Even though the display may look like ancient technology, but I digress. Coming up on the European dead zone. Gonna be our new home for a while. Look. Do you recognize it? That's where we're supposed to go. That thing? They call it the Shard of the Traveler. I call it not a place you want to go poking around. Unfortunately, it's a place that we have to go poking around. I'm assuming this is the hub area of Destiny. Nah, I'm going on 52 minutes now. Oh boy. <clears throat> ah! Well, it is definitely the hub ward, but um, I'm clearly you don't have access to it. Wee! I'm at least going to be useful before I go. Hmm. Oh, I'm glad to see you safe. I am Tyra, Tyra Karn. I'm sorry. Have we met before? Losing my connection to the light has been. Disorienting. Now, hmm. I understand you seek the shard of the traveler. I too have dreamt of it. Its jagged, broken edge. A wound that never heals. But I do not trust its pull. Like us, the shard no longer knows the light. Not since the traveler cast it off during the collapse. For centuries it has twisted and corrupted everything around it where it lies is now a place of death if you are determined to go remember we guardians are no longer immortal now like the famous saying goes the light out of the darkness you can have one or the other oh, i got rid of my guns too wow <laughs> I should have saw that one coming. Do you want rabbit or dog? Want. I mean, again, it seems weird, but I guess it makes sense. We've all been depending on the light of the traveler and not embracing other things, like the darkness. Where there is light, there is darkness. And out of the darkness will come a light. Out of the light will also come out as darkness. It's a weird combination of things, although I, I don't think that quote actually works. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> although that's how I at least think of it. Let's do the thing. This is... Whew, a lot of civilization. For me, at least. Of course, I've been living outside the city half my life. So, anyway, heard you want to go poke around that busted-up hunk of traveling. You guardians have a weird idea of a good time. 
Oh well. Lewis and I know plenty about trusting your gut. So I'm not about to stop you. I got enough to deal with here. Take that ship you flew here. At least it'll get you back faster. See all these refugees. Yeah, I know. Later. All these refugees. Yeah. <laughs> Move on from that. I already have this piece. Stop telling me that I have it. Fine, I'll get rid of it. Oi! Huh. Sucker field. The farm. The Red War, Spark, Quarantine, Section 236, European Dead Zone. Okay, and there seems to be a couple of other places, and along with... Oh, that's a raid. And then I'm assuming the rest will be added into with DLC. Well, I am going to stop here, and I will have this live stream this for tomorrow. So if you guys want to see more, make sure you press that like button, and I will be playing more Destiny 2. And I think, regardless, I'll probably still play Destiny anyway. So, yeah. How does this soccer physic work? Mm, ah. Yeah. But first I ended up playing with the soccer ball, right? Okay. I'm so confused! <laughs> hmm. Yeah, we can talk to physics. Alright, so I will see you guys tomorrow. Adios.